Welcome back, everybody. This is Nick Tukorex, and this mod is Briegel's FJ80 Land Cruiser VX. And right off the bat, I've got to say that the chassis here reminds me a lot of the FJ40 4x4. Not the 6x6, obviously, because this is only a four-wheel drive, not a six-wheel drive. But this chassis setup reminds me a lot of that, plus the engine sound. Wow, I never realized how far out you could zoom. Oh my god, are you serious? Anyways, oh god, I gotta go all the way back in now. Damn it. Okay, so anyways, I am going to you know, get your standard body, get your adventure body, that's not what I meant to do. Got your crawl, wait, what? Oh, different bodies make different things available. Uh, crawler body is nothing. Explorer body is camper trailer. Oh, yes! Spare blah, 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 blah. Let me do some different angling on this. I do like how Briegel does his uh, his vehicles, where you've got the different styles, bozzies, like this one's got, you've got your adventuring stuff, you've got your stuff up here to go camping, you got your spare tire on the back, you can take your camping trailer along with you, and then on your next set of tires. I'm going to go with the fall tires. Anyways, on your, your next body, you've got a different style uh, front bumper, and it's this one's got the, the full roll cage, or what, however it is, you know? I'm actually going to haul the trailer around, I think. All right, get my camper trailer out. Oh, that's freaking awesome. I love those old school styled campers. But yes, I do have to say that this truck so far reminds me a lot of the FJ40. And the, visually, yeah, it's completely different. Still got the loud, loud exhaust sound, or engine sound of what the uh, Briggles mods normally do. Oh, this thing is just floating, man. I'm so glad I got that suspension fix, or that suspension deal fixed with the, the plus files. Um, it, it's one of the things that you can adjust with the Spin Tires Plus files. Well, I have to turn down my headphones, and I forgot pushing the button for the map does nothing for stopping the vehicle. Yay me for being smartish -ish stupid. Yay. Anyways, um, wow, the trailer was drifting around that corner. Uh-oh, I'm jackknifed. Wow, this actually has some pretty good, uh... Uh, what's it called? Dynamics when it comes to having the trailer, because... Come on, stop. Thank you. Go into low. Because we're now we're trailing. While pulling a camper. Anyways, um... When it comes to pulling the trailer which is caught up yep it's the trailer it's gotta be oh there's some uh with uh having to back it up and you know turning the wheels the opposite way and, and yeah 
That's one thing about this game that is pretty freaking cool. It is actually realistic about certain things like that. I do like how he's got the the tail, I guess you would call it like a, a canary yellowish for both the truck and the camper. It's a very nice touch. You know, I've seen some mods where they get the, the camper just looks like a big old semi-trailer. Or, uh, what was the other one I saw? It just, it was like a black truck and the, the camper was white. Or something like that. I don't remember exactly. Alright, there to... There. And yeah, I know I'm winching a lot, but my my trailer isn't exactly suited for this style of trail riding. Go ahead, get that off. Oh, come on, come on, you big old beast of a truck. Maybe I should have taken some different tires. I don't know. Oh well, whatever. Uh... Oh god, that's not going to work very well. And that's going to be my only option. Yeah. Well, here goes nothing. And yes, I got my wheels turned the opposite way of the winch point because I don't want it climbing that hill. And my trailer is still stuck. Oh wait, there it goes, there it goes. Yay! Trailer's moving. Oh crap, I gotta keep the pay. Keep closer to pay closer attention, and there goes my trailer. No, you don't, you bastard. Don't do that to me. Not right now. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. Anyways, I gotta keep closer attention, or pay closer attention to the trail, so I don't drive off. It's bad enough to drive off with just a truck, but trying to pull a trailer and go camping and shit too oh god let's see I don't even know why I brought the trailer with I just decided hey I guess this is gonna be a trailer challenge um yeah so anyways I am driving Going down, and my back end is glitching into the ground. Alright, which. Uh, this is not one I would ever want to try and do with the. Uh... Oh, what is the name of that new map? I've been doing a lot of uh, my videos on it lately. The. Uh... Oh, Tippy Whippy, or whatever it's called. That map would not be one for pulling a trailer. I think one day I'm going to try it. And I'll probably call it the most difficult trailer pull ever. Or something along those lines. Because I don't know of any other map that would have such a challenging time for trailers. I mean this one, it's getting caught up. But then again, it's a very low trailer. Oh, for a second there, it looked like I had the infinity symbols on the, the tire, or the hub center caps of the tires, rims, whatever, taco beans. Randomness coming out of my mouth, like, like, stupidness. 
better than what I was originally going to say, and no, I'm not going to say it, because I don't want to. And go on to advanced. And you advance and go! So yeah, um, this truck is actually doing really good considering it's pulling a trailer that is not designed for this type of off-roading. And that's one of the things about the Briegel's trucks I like. Uh, his FJ40 4x4, the FJ40 6x6, this is the FJ80 Land Cruiser. Um, son of a bitch. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Let's see if I can't get myself out of this. Right there. Neck itches. Thank you. I don't want to lose the trailer. I really don't. I have a feeling I might be losing it. Whoa. Right now ish. Probably because it's glitched. Advanced. And yes, I am going to winch again just to make sure I get the trailer up. Or try to make sure I get the trailer up, anyways, as long as the trailer doesn't actually hatch, which it didn't. Yay. And I'm going to continue on down this trail for a few more minutes. As you can see, the trailer is not wanting to go right where it needs to be going. So, yeah. Um, let's do a little bit more winching up that way. I should probably use the winch on the trailer a little bit. Get it more centered to where it needs to be rather than where it wants to be. Let's do that. That. I'm going to advance there to way up there. Holy crap. Wow. Oh yeah, that's that spin tires plus stuff. Changing the uh, amount of length that the winch has. And that's the bad part is I don't even have this thing maxed out on where, what it could be. The, uh, I think I took it to 20 or 25-ish as to where it can go up to I think a total of plus 44. And I'm stuck. Anyway, I think I'm going to leave this one here. So, if you guys have enjoyed this, please like, favorite, and if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. Have fun.